All right, what's up everybody? It's Aspire here, and I'm back with a new tutorial in Sony Vegas. Um, I decided to do this new series called Popular Effects, where I just um, do tutorials on popular effects that I've seen in edits or edits, like in edits that I've made myself. So I mean, I got this request a couple of times, and um, let's get started. All right, so this effect right here is pretty clean. As you can see, I used it in my latest edit right now. If you guys wanna check that out, I have a link in the description. But yeah, so um, to do this effect, first thing you wanna do is, you want to go to um, Lens Blur, which is a BCC plugin. Let me just try to find it real quick. All right, here it is. All right, so you just want to drag this on. All right, so um, as you can see, the blur is a little high at first, so I'm gonna just lower it down to like 4.5. All right, and um, it depends on what flow you're using for your edit, but uh, you just want to like move over just a couple of frames like this all right like right here then you want to hit this animate button right here and move this keyframe over like this and then go back to the beginning set it to zero and since this is like a fast blur effect you don't want to go all the way to the end but you want to go like just a few frames over like right here and set this so i'm gonna set it to 1.5 and then then you want to go to the end set it to zero okay after you do that you want to um go to uh, this is just like a normal vegas plugin it's called glow so you just want to drag this on all right so when you first add it it doesn't look very good so i'm gonna show you guys how to fix that so the first thing you want to do is lower the suppression down like that okay and then you want to lower the intensity down Oh yeah, that looks pretty good. All right, so um, you don't want to go like the same amount, the same frame point you did for the blur. You want to go like a little bit more. So I'm gonna just move over a couple of frames, like right here. All right, that should be good. Then so you want to animate the intensity with the same button. They just want to move this keyframe. Same thing we did before. And then this time you can just go all the way to the end or wherever you want it to stop, like this. And um. That's basically it for this effect, but um, there's like countless other things you can add to make it look better. Like um, I usually add like a film burn over it, just to make it look a little bit cleaner. And you can add like lens correction if you want to like warp the screen a little bit. That looks pretty clean as well. So I'm gonna show you guys a preview real quick. Alright, so as you can see, this effect looks really clean. It looks good for like indie and rock edits or like really chill edits. So um, if you guys like this tutorial, please um like and subscribe. And also, if you have any other tutorial suggestions, just um let me know in the forum or in the comments. And um thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you next time. We got this rap shit down to a mad science, the biochemist, everything on right heart, hieroglyphics. Welcome to the round table where we plot on our challenges, king off the other.